Well, here in Calgary, we're used to rodeo, we're used to show jumping, but now we're gonna show you something called Liberty. And Brennan is here from Odessio. Just tell us a little bit about what is Liberty Work with Horses. Liberty is basically working with the horses without any sort of reins or bridles. As you can see, the horses, the only thing unnatural they have is the protection. Um, so it's really more about the relationship and vocal, physical commands to get them to do different figures and patterns and, and various maneuvers like that. Now you're an aerialist in this I show, am. but you're also involved in the Liberty. How did you get involved in Liberty work? Well, I've been with the, the company for about three years. So I started when I first came doing Liberty just with one horse. Um, and you know, over time you just kind of evolve and you learn more. Um, and luckily Fanny uh, was willing to teach me some things. So now I'm her backup in the show. So sometimes in the show I get to work with the four horses, which is, is very exciting for me. It's different, it, it keeps the show fresh and I, I mean, it, it's been really great over three years being able to build these relationships with the horses, which is very new for me. And I would think that the relationship is probably the most important part because there are no ties to these yeah, horses. Yeah, exactly. The, you really have to train them in, in a way that it, it's a two-way relationship because they are free. They know, they know that if they're not happy, they can just run off and they can run a lot faster than I can. So really the training that you use is really just to show how comfortable you are with each other. Um, so the, it's, yeah, it, you kind of have to go slowly and there's a lot of give and take and just a lot of patience. That was the hardest part for me. And they're so attentive to your body movements that when I was first learning, it was hard for me to, to understand what my body was doing because I wouldn't notice the, the subtle cues I would give them of you know having my shoulders forward so they would run faster or running up so they'd slow down and I'm thinking, what's going on, what's happening? And Fanny would be like, well, you told them to slow down, you told them to speed up. So it's been really interesting for me um, to, to really explore that. What do you hear from audience members, especially after a Liberty Act like this? Uh, honestly, I think uh, people are always amused when the horses do a little misbehave um, because there's something there's something so joyful about seeing a horse just gallop around and then kind of they get it out of their system and they usually end up right back where they're supposed to be. It's, it's, it kind of reminds me of a little kid throwing a little temper tantrum like, nah, I don't want to. I'm like, okay, all right, I'm good now. Let's do it. <laughs> so for the horse people out there, how hard is it to to get into contact and get into a, a rhythm with a horse to do liberty work? It, well, I mean, like I said, I've been here for three years and I still feel like I don't really know them that well. It, it, it's always a, a new day is a new experience. Um, in the number, we have up to 32 horses all in liberty on the stage. So there's a lot going on. You not only have to worry about your relationship with your horses, but how the different groups of horses will interact. And you know, we have stallions and geldings, and, and seeing just kind of how how the horses act around each other and dealing with the, the changes as they come. Now you're here till June first. Why should somebody come and see Odessio? I think there's something for everybody. If horses aren't your thing, you know, we have aerial work, we have lots of acrobatics. You saw some of the, the, the trick riding, we have dressage, just the set itself, you know, the, the huge projector screen we have, the stage floods with water, a hill, there, you know, I, I really think that there's something for everybody to enjoy. So something for everybody here at Odessa, come and check it out.